So in this video, I'll show you how you can download the macro and um, use it and how you can import configs. So I've seen a lot of people having troubles in um, downloading the macro or not sure what to do. So in this video, I'll show you how you can do it. So the first thing you want to do is obviously you're going to switch off your antivirus right here. Now, the reason why you wanted to switch off is because, well, your antivirus thinks it is a virus. It is a Trojan, but it is not. So you can just easily do this and switch off your real time protection. All right. Next, you're going to download the macro right here. It's easy. You shouldn't have any problem with downloading something. You're going to open it. All right. So something super easy. You're just going to extract it. Right click to extract it. Now, if you're using WinRAR, you got to extract it via WinRAR. So you got it. Next, this is your ASCDX. Am I right? We are going to right click and we're going to run as admin. It's create exclusion. Basically, it makes it so that it doesn't be, it won't be deleted by your antivirus. So it's just going to, it's just going to do its stuff. Once you're done, you're just going to press any key to continue right here. Now, if you're using any antivirus like Norden, Avast, or even more complex um, antiviruses, you got to exclude from there. If not, it won't work. You now you got your macro. All right. So I'll show you how you can input a config. All right. Import a config. Okay. Super easily. You just want to hit over to your, you want to hit over here, right? There's many free configs you can use, but if you're doing infinites, because we are, I think everyone wants to micro infinites, you're going to download foodisland.json. What? What is this? It's basically a config, right? Because the macro comes with nothing. So you got to download it, all right? And I'm just going to leave it here for now. Now let's open the macro. So let the macro load in first and i'm actually just gonna go to my roblox real quick so i can um, show you guys um just check av uh, astd free and just scroll up in the discord you will be able to see all the uh, all the uh, setup guides everything here your roblox avatar skill as well avatar skill you do need that as well um make sure you do have these switch on um yeah next you just want to head over to your infinite and uh you just want to put in go to your unit config and you want to press import a setting okay so as you can see i'm at downloads here i'm just going to go to my food island.json i'm going to click on it as you can see everything changes right i go to my main and i'm going to save settings now this is really important if you do not save settings this won't work and i will crash out on it okay next if you want to put a private server you want to put a webhook you can check the pins or the questions it's right there okay you want to change to time street speed you want to join ps all of these you can literally put it here okay there's nothing else that you need to know other than making your own config now this part of the video is to show you how you can make your own config okay so assuming if you guys have a different type of unit or anything this is the um the one for you okay so let's say you want a macro maybe story am i right you want to you know macro giant island for example oh yeah i'm just going to use this for an example let's go so i'm just going to show a screenshot of the um the the, the, the tutorial on the right but you can also listen to me so you got action one enabled if you don't if you have this enabled it will do this action if you have this disabled it will skip it or it will just not do it at all all right so next you got unit slot obviously your unit slot right here you can rename it if you want you don't really need to name it you can leave it unknown but for for people who get confused easily you can name it all right so as you can see my unit slot is goku i'm just going to rename it as goku because i can all right what does wait second mean basically it will wait this set amount of seconds to do that action so uh let's say if i want to wait 10 seconds it will wait 10 seconds to place on my unit or upgrade my unit so i'm not going to put anything here because i don't want any delay obviously now let's say i want to place down my goku right here cool as you can see it has the coordinates right here now what does action mean action is basically abilities um you don't really need to care about that unless if you have abilities so that's still fine priority swaps and placement conditions are not set so you don't need to care about that next let's say what if i wanted to place down my farm i want to place goku i want to place my farm and i want to place down and i want to max my farm and i want to max my goku all right so it's really simple i am just gonna place down let's i'm just gonna equip my farm real quick as my fourth 
uh, slot. So unit slot 4, I'm just going to rename this as my form unit right here. Okay, and I'm just going to click on maybe here. And I'm going to set the upgrade to max. Right. And let's say I want to go back to upgrading my Goku. For example, for example, I will have the same slot as well. But do remember that you're going to have your place unit switched off. Why? If not, it will try to replace a unit over it, which is something that we do not want. Now next, for the coordinates, we just want to have the same coordinates as well. So it will go back to upgrade my Goku. Next, you're going to have your upgrade set to max and that is it. Right? This is an extremely simple way. Right? That can I, The most simplest way I can explain it to you. The first action will place down a Goku on the hill. The next one is going to place down a farm and it's going to max it out. The next action is going to go back to the Goku and it's going to max it out. Alright, next, once you're done, save your settings and that is it. There's literally nothing. You can't fumble it, alright? It's going to the story, it's going to here right now and it's going to the heart. It's going to go to the giant island and it's going to do casual because I didn't set it to hard mode as well. Done. Done and dusted. You shouldn't have any problems. If you have problems, it is most likely your setup isn't correct. So please set that out yourself. And yeah, that is it. Uh, if you have any other issues, check the pins first before asking a question. Try to troubleshoot it yourself. If you do have questions, do ask. I'm not saying not to ask, but yeah. So that's it.